Hello Hiptubers and welcome back to my channel and in today's video I will show you how you can make a simple circuit that a LED like this that is self blinking LED will control this ordinary light bulb to blinking just like that. How? I'm gonna explain. Let's start. In my previous video I showed that I receive from Aliexpress 20 pieces of N-Pen transistor BD681 which is Darlington transistor that can handle with heatsink up to 4 amps. Using this transistor this ordinary bulb will blink but will be controlled with this LED. Let me explain the circuit now. Okay, here it is the circuit diagram. It's very simple, you can see. It needs only one, two, three, four, five, together with the ordinary light bulb, five electronic components to make this circuit. Here it is the N-Pen transistor PD681 pinout. It's an emitter collector base. And for the self-blinking LED, you need only one resistor of 1 kilo ohm for the blinking because this circuit will work on 5 volts we need one photodiode that will control the, the base of the transistor and on the collector it's hook up the light bulb and on the emitter is connected on ground when the photo resistor detects light that will change the value to the base and the light bulb will blink. And here it is, the whole circuit soldered in free form, the light bulb, the transistor, here it is the resistor for the LED and on the LED with super glue is attached the photo resistor. That is a nice trick. The photoresistor is fixed on the LED and detecting light. That self blinking LED will change the value to the base of the transistor. Very simple and unique way to make a blinker for ordinary light bulbs. Now I'm gonna test it. Turning off the studio lights, connecting first the negative right here, okay, and now the positive, and look, working fine. You can see that it's pulling around 300 milliampers. And look how simple circuit can work in fine in action using only cell blinking LED, a photoresistor, one transistor, n pen transistor, and a bulb. I love it. If you like it, please give a thumb up, share the video, and subscribe to my channel. That was all for today's video. See ya!